It's a well-made little bracelet. But I don't know who's, uh, let's see if that, let's see if this little teardrop drop thing is glass or crystal or just for the heck of it. Yes, it is. So that's cute. That's a little crystal. Here's a pendant. It's got that moonstone effect. Here's the back. Here's a friend makes life sweeter, and that's so true. What a pretty little pen. Here's three um, bangles. Here's a little snowman. Very nicely done. Ceramic by Gantz. Quality. Ceramic. Ooh. Here's a little toe ring with hearts. Turn it off. We have our shell stretchy bracelets. And this was a memory wire bracelet. It's in an ombre effect. Very cute. And then you have this other green one. It's dyed green. Very pretty colors. And we have two more here. Very pretty pearls. They have wear on them. These feel like they're glass. Very heavy necklace. But the pearls are pretty worn. But these are very pretty. That, that. These are pretty beads on there. Those are Aurora Borealis washed beads. I'm going to put that in the craft lot. <clears throat> and then we have this carousel horse stamp from the post office pins. March Company, made in Taiwan, can't read anything else, let's see, Albuquerque, New Mexico, non-exclusive license of the United States Postal Service, stamp design, 1995, and it's got a 1-800 number at the bottom. Well, that's very cool. Here's an infinity with a little green stone in the middle. Tack pen. And then another little tack pen that says Dare Graduate. And that, my friend, is all. That was a fun auction. If you haven't um, been to Cindy's channel, and she has Facebook auctions, but I got this, I think, on a YouTube au auction. I haven't done any of the Facebook 
Facebook once, but go check out our channel. It's uh, Cindy Lovin, or Cindy Loves Jewelry. And um, our auctions are a lot of fun, so y'all go check them out. Let's see what else I have. Okay, I'm back. The next one is from um, Patsy Craftsy on um, the 29th. I've got two wins from her for a total of $29. And it came in this package. It came in this box. I just opened it, but I didn't open it online. Uh oh, it's kind of smashed down there. And... It's a beautiful little owl necklace. I love it. Thank you very much, Patsy. On this beautiful chain. And it's got a spring ring clasp. Nice long chain. Adorable. I love it. Thank you very much. And then... It was this necklace. It's got the Nolan, Nolan Miller Glamour Collection. There it is right there. It's got the card and everything. It's in its package with its warranty. Lifetime warranty. Beautiful necklace. Look at that. Crystal and those CZs. On this um, ball and chain necklace. It's got his tag here. It says it was made in China and then it has his name on the other side. Nolan Miller. Yeah, I believe this is sterling. I don't see it marked anywhere, but I'm going to check. I will test it because I believe his pieces were sterling. I'm surprised there's no... Uh, finish on the end of that extender. So I'm not sure about the chain as much as I am the pendant. Except the chain does have his Noah Miller tag. So let me look at this again. Oh yeah. He's designed for Anne Margaret, Jane Seymour, Jacqueline Smith, Barbara Streisand, Seth, Sophia Lauren, Elizabeth Taylor. Elizabeth Taylor's collection is outstanding. Linda Evans, Diana Carroll, and Joan Collins. For appearances, bone, for appearances both on and off screen, now I have the opportunity to design for you. I have a few of his pieces in my jewelry box too. He's been a designer for over uh, 30 years. I'm not sure if he's passed away or not. There was one of the designers they had on QVC. He was one of them, but one of them passed away, and I can't remember if it was him or not. Never use jewelry cleaner or sonic cleaner. Makeup and hairspray are your jewelry's worst enemy. Always put your jewelry on after your makeup and perfume and hairspray. To clean, dip your jewelry in a mild solution of liquid soap and water, then rinse in warm water and gently dry with a soft cloth. That's pretty cool. This was QVC. So I'm thrilled to get this. His, pen, his pieces were pretty expensive. 
on QVC. Because I didn't have many, I just bought a few. But that's beautiful. I love it. And I love that it came in its box. And I love my little owl. Can't tell if those stones are black or red. They almost look reddish. But I love that. Okay. Thank you, Patsy. You need to check out her channel. It's Patsy Craftsy. And Craftsy is spelled with a Z-Y at the end. And Patsy is with a Z-Y at the end, too. And um, she has a lot of fun auctions. She has really nice pieces. So go check her out. And I have another one right here. It's from Barbie. Y'all know Ken and Barbie. Her channel is Barbie Crafts. Again, I always like to cut the corner. You need to do that if you get clothes in the mail too because they will pack them, but they're packing them tight to save you money on shipping too. So, I have to do this some more. See, there's something right there because it's not wanting to. what I do so I don't cut in and cut a necklace or do something silly like that. So. There we go. This was back on 531 too. And she always sends an invoice. So I paid $17 for the slot and there were two auctions that I won. And she sent me a thank you gift. So thank you Barbie. Ken and Barbie are a lot of fun to watch. They're, um, that's their real names, Ken and Barbie. I always enjoy their auctions. I don't make them to all of them, but I try to get to most of them. That's a beautiful little necklace with hearts, interlocking hearts, and a lobster claw clasp, and a little patriotic apple pen. Love that. Here's a pretty little um, ribbed, dome ribbed ring. Looks very nice. Fits me better on that finger. Thank you, Barbie. It's got something written in it. Let's see what that is. It is 18 karat gold electroplated. That's why it looks so nice. Thank you, Barbie. And Ken. You can't thank one without the other. And look at these two little rose stick pens. Adorable. Both have their backs on them. So thank you very much, Miss Barbie and Mr. Ken. I like they use this kind of tape too, because it comes off easy. Oh yeah, say that and then have trouble getting it off. It really does come off easy, guys. And then you're able to reuse the wrap, and that's a good thing to do, to reuse and not just throw away. Ooh, I was a winner on this one. I was a winner, winner, chicken dinner. Pretty brooch. Here's the back. It was a, I 
Can't read that. Uh oh, something fell. Oh, it's Cora. Yes, ma'am, I want it. It's got a little wear on it, but I don't care. It's very pretty. I'm glad I want it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then this one. Nicely wrapped, as always. Oh. Woohoo! Precious. I don't know if that was sterling or not. Oh, my magnet fell on the floor. No, it's not magnet, so I'm going to test it. Because I know she doesn't test her stuff. And then I won this. Very beautiful. Isn't that lovely? Beautiful brooch. Very pretty. Alrighty. Thank you very much, Barbie. That was fabulous. And thank you for all the nice thank you gifts. And I'm so glad I won this Coro. Because you know I love Coro. So awesome. Well guys, I have some errands to run today. And so that's going to be my last opening for now. I appreciate you spending your time with me watching this video. I'll be doing more of these soon. I've been kind of lax on doing them. Been doing a lot with family and friends. But everyone have a blessed day, and I will see you again soon. Bye.